in marketing, yeah, there's so many things you could do. And, and when you look at the site of the 100, that's what it's about. These are all the things you could do, but you have a finite amount of time, so you pick the things that you want to do that are fun and exciting and interesting to you. And that's not going to be everything that we're involved in as a group. It's going to be things that speak to you. Uh, what I teach school owners is I teach them how to take any subject, give or take a few exceptions, that they really feel passionate about and turn it into a solid, uh, substantive, ingenious, genuine marketing campaign that helps them, that helps their students, that helps the people in their sphere of influence, that helps the community, that's good for the martial arts community and good for the world. It could be any subject. You just have to pick, but make it fun, make it exciting. And then here's the real key. Since you're only one person, you've only got so much time. What if you could inspire something like that in every one of your students? And each one of them were out doing something that was fun for them. That was a part of their martial arts training, but was more spiritual or emotional or mental and not just the physical part. Yeah. When you can uh, be one person and really pick some good projects that you can just work on day after day, year after year, because you love the subject and it means something to you, Think of the power you have when you can mobilize 50 or 100 or 300 or 500 people to each embrace their mission from a martial arts perspective. That's great advertising. That's great empowerment. That's leadership. It's everything we're after. It's just a new shift of thinking for the instructor. It's kind of a redesign of our role.